A 35 year old Vernon man is lucky to be alive after breaking his femur and dislocating his shoulder in a snowmobiling collision near Lumby. The Vernon search and rescue team and their winch helicopter team responded to the area around Park Mountain after the man's friends sent out an SOS signal. And it was bad. It, it was it was the best case scenario for something that was just horrible. I got in a random head on with uh, with my buddy's friend who came out with us first day ever and uh, he basically landed on me. I dislocated my left shoulder and, and I broke my left femur. Uh, I mean, I've been doing this for a long time. I, it's been the better part of my life spending the mountains and I know, uh, I know how bad that situation is and I just freaked out. It wasn't even, it wasn't the pain. It was, it was just like, oh my God, I might die. Let me tell you, it was hell on earth laying there. Must have asked my friends 200 times if they were actually on their way. They were able to locate the, um, the individual and uh, he had uh, life-threatening injuries. I, I was just terrified and didn't want to die, to be honest. It, it, the thought was there in my head that I'm, this might be it. Definitely the craziest thing I've ever had happen to me. They're, uh, they're quick thinking, um, cool heads, and use of, of uh, available technology made this possible. Just thanks for everything they did. Thanks for being fast, and thanks for the comfort they gave me. And pretty bad injuries, but at the same time, I, I know how lucky I am, and I'm just kind of, I'm just happy to be here. Mitchell said every snowmobiler needs to carry an inReach because it could save your life. For Castanet News, I'm Alana Kelly in Kelowna. Find your next boat, bike, RV, or snowmobile in our Power Sports section. You can find it in the Classifieds button on the yellow masthead.